the coins I like, what you gon' do? Man, pool, please, I hi, hi. Order no, order no, order no. Where does it stop? Nobody knows. It's a revolution, ayy. Bitcoin is the one, no substitution, ayy. We should see in your go, be it's order no revolution. Welcome to Ordinal Revolution. My name is Yago B, and I'm going to be your uh, host today for this new tutorial. Uh, we just did a tutorial on how to bridge over to Merlin Chain um, Bitcoin from the Bitcoin side. Uh, today is going to be how to stake on the Merlin seal, which just opened up 30 minutes ago, and it is 719 Central Time, so uh, February 8th. So yeah, it's gonna be very exciting. A lot of people have been waiting on this. Um, man, they've been just delivering over and over, right? So let's just jump right into this. Um, I'm gonna pre present my screen real quick. All right. So the first thing you need to do, again, you need to make sure you have enough Bitcoin in the wallet that you wanna use. I actually ended up just kind of uh, sending a, a bit, well, using one with like, not a ton of assets in it because this is for testing so you gotta be careful we trust jeff and his team and everything but it's not them that we're worried about right um but um and then make sure that wallet has enough bitcoin for you to pay the fee to bridge over right so i already did all that we're gonna get started so you're gonna go to merlinchain.io and then um this first button here that says bridge to merlin seal you're gonna click that and then you're gonna connect your wallet in the top right here i'm gonna go with unisat and i'm connected right there okay so this is the exciting part right because we've only been able to see the assets as bitcoin here if you click on this it shows all the round one for staking uh or bitcoin layer one assets that were selected for staking on merlin seal so i'm going to do a bitmap i'm just going to do a single bitmap first so i'm going to click slick bitmap there i'm going to do uh just this uh, let's see let me do a high number one um 442 okay then uh we'll do 446 actually there we go then i'm gonna hit confirm and then um so this is where if you do like the the team captains this is where you put your your captain's code here i'm just gonna do this first right now just as an example so i'm not going to put anything in there although ordinary revolution will have a captain code there so look out for that if you want to join our team because everybody benefits um it's an accum cumulative total amount of bitcoin that in value that gets uh counted um okay so now let's go to the staking we're going to hit the staking button right here the blue one okay it says um you have become your own team captain okay so this is just let me know because i'm doing it for an example each team has a maximum of five people so when you do that uh team you, you only can go up to five so hit okay then i'm going to do fastest gas for this so i'm gonna confirm i'm gonna sign i'm gonna hit okay and i'm gonna sign again and it says staking successful. The transfer is successful. For more details, please check the history below. It takes three blocks confirmation to successfully bridge in the tokens. So uh, this is, I guess they're they're doing a three block transaction period for this. You can check your transfer history again, like or like I showed you on the last video, and it shows bitmap was the asset, bitmap type, amount only did one from my wallet address. So this is really good for you know making sure that you track you know, everything that you do stake or bridge over in general. You have the transaction ID here, and this is, you know, on the mempool side. So you can see right there, right? That's a transaction ID. All right, so let's go back. Okay, cool. So um, let me check my points. So I don't have any, this is gonna be your dashboard. When you check your points, this is gonna be your dashboard, right? This is really cool. You can see the asset. The, you can see the bitmap uh, that was bridged over for staking. The value of it is 0 0.00584 Bitcoin. Um, and you're, you're probably not going to see the points amount until the three transactions, right? So we can wait on that. But that's it, guys. And then, like, you know, like I said, don't, this is just for an example. So that's not our captain code there. But it's really simple, guys. I mean, this is, 
I mean, how, how much easier can I get than that? Right. You can bridge, click here to bridge more. And then since I'm already signed in, it's, you know, it's going to keep track of what I've been doing. And that is it guys. I mean, this is awesome. Honestly, this was my first time to do it and I'm glad that it was just so smooth and seamless. Um, but yeah, after three tra blocks of uh, transaction, um, then you'll be able to see the points. Um, there is a Merlin seal tab up here in the top right under your thing. And you can always go to your dashboard with that. Um, that is going to be it guys. Quick five minute tutorial video. Glad it was quick and, and smooth and everything, but um, we will um, go live tonight. Don't miss that because we're going to have Sam from the ordinal side on. It's going to be 9 p.m. Eastern, uh, February 8th, which is today. Um, and so that should be a, a really fun live. Uh, we can do some Q&A. You guys have some questions ready for Sam and us. You know, we, we, we'll probably end up doing something fun, like maybe a giveaway or something. We always do that. So uh, make sure you join. And that is it. We will see you guys later. Uh, take it easy, guys. Ordinal Revolution. Let's go.